It's Walden, I tell you! Don't be thick, Bron. Everyone knows Odin leads the wild hunt. Eivor, who leads the wild hunt? Odin, why? I was explaining to him the way of Oscar A. This one wants to turn it into a pageant. Not a pageant, a parade. I was thinking some of us could dress up like gods from both lands. Maybe you could lead it, Eivor. Oscorea isn't a celebration. It's when the veil between the worlds grows thin, and the dead will haunt us if we don't honor them. True. And they say the gods come to Midgard to hunt. Not just beasts, but men also. It wouldn't be wise to draw their attention. You are wise to be wary of the gods' wrath, Dane. <laughs> but it's not by hiding that you'll evade the wild hunt. I told you not to pester the locals, uncle. Have you been in the herds again? Don't patronize me, you little shit! And you will call me Brother Maxwell like everyone else! No one calls you that. I've seen you around planting your smoking pots everywhere. The whole village smells like a seer's hut. Those pots are placed where the fabric of the veil is weakest. Letting us perceive unseen threats before they are upon us. I'm sorry, Eivor. He shows up like this without warning. I told him he could stay with me while he's here. You're right to offer hospitality. And we should mark the Wild Hunt in some way. It's a source of fear for people of both fates. And how do you think we should mark Oscorea, Eivor? With tests of skill and strength. Like Tyrus archery range. Show the hunt, they'll find no easy prey here. Swinta is setting up another event since her last tournament was so successful. Good. Tell her we'll use it, not to celebrate, but to prepare for the wild hunt. Tell her yourself. You're the one leading this preparation. Me? I didn't. And be sure to visit Gudmund's homage to the dead. Or didn't you notice the ship in the middle of the settlement? I noticed the ship. Good. May Odin's wisdom guide you. So no parade. I have a better job for you, Bronn. You'll be the judge of whose actions will impress the gods. You'll be the keeper of the tokens. I will be the best judge you have ever seen, Eivor. Go Zinovid about the tokens. Tell him I sent you, and I'll come find you later. My herbs let us see the invisible. But it's you, as leader, who must cross the veil and discover the mysteries of the Nether Realm. <sighs> I never said I was leading. Maybe I should have let Braun have his parade. Good day to you all, Wynn. Ah, good day, Eivor. I hear you've taken charge of the Fall Festival. <laughs> I look forward to, uh, what do you call it again? Oscorea. I wouldn't say I'm in charge. I just talk to people. <laughs> oh, don't be so modest. I'm sure you're playing a greater role than you realize. Um, by the way, you'll want to keep a close eye on Braun's uncle. He's been leaving flaming pots everywhere. I know. He's a strange one. He may even be mad, but I don't think there's evil in his heart. Oh, I, I'm not suggesting any malicious intent, but Braun did mention he once burnt down a church. <laughs> Accidentally, of course. Oh. And a short while ago, I saw him heading towards the edge of the forest with an armload of kindling. He'll set the forest ablaze. 
Where can I find him? Follow the smoke. Sunan, guide me. is not thick, but it clouds the hooker more than it obscures sight. If your thoughts grow cloudy, look deeper within and seek clarity through your inner eye. I didn't think I spoke those thoughts aloud. I know what it's like to stand on the threshold of another world. I think you grow drunk on your own fumes. Do you think it mere chance that brought you here? No. No near. Leave little to chance. Then open your mind to the worlds beyond our own, as the veil that hides them is pulled away. What would you have me see? It's not about my desires, but yours. What do you seek? I seek to protect my people from the wild hunt. You'll need to cross the veil, face your greatest fear, meet your own worst enemy. Greatest fear? It'll take more than herb-induced visions to terrify me. Spirits of the dead, the shot may wander this nether world. There is a force here, invisible.
Monk wasn't so mad after all. Stand aside, spirit. I come for the rune. I do not wish to add to your grief. This spirit could be my twin. There is murder in its eyes. Only one Eivor will walk away. joy at having vanquished it. That fight was more tiring than I thought. I grow weak. Hit Sidasta, Mini Vekir out days. He got the You do enjoy building your ships, Goodmund, even if they're not going anywhere. I see people have been carving the names of the dead onto the hall. Haig, Asa, Aslog. These are names I haven't heard since my youth. We lost many on that evil night. Sven, a big man with a fine touch. He left his mark on many of us. Dag, a fighter until the end. I wouldn't call him a good man, but his bravery could not be denied. There are my parents. Rasta. She traded her life for her child. I will make sure it was worth it. Varin. He gave his life to the Raven Clan. May the gods honor his sacrifice. That is for the old father to judge. Strange. This name has no message to honor it. Kaf. It's not a name I know. Goodman, do you know someone named Kaf? No. It's the one name not carved into the wood, only scribbled in charcoal. Did you see who wrote it? Maybe. Someone I didn't know came by earlier. Limping and staggering, like he was on his last legs. Didn't see his face. And you didn't speak to him? He didn't speak to me. He went that way, if you're interested. I don't like unanswered questions so close to home. If this stranger was lame, he could not have gotten far. <laughs> Sic faciam wimporfelium et ambulato per yoga. Lancum canibus ad olibitque felini mendacium et humilis.
Tira, did you see a man limp past? I did. He was heading north of the Longhouse. Have a look, Sunan. the attack from across the West River. If not for my warning, they'd all be dead. He was a lookout on the West River. There must be some place with a better view. See the unseen. Perhaps it will reveal something of the dead man's fate.
Once before, when Stierbjörn exiled a man from Fornburg.
Now that I've uncovered Calf's tail, I'll write it on Goodman's ship. Rune of protection paid in blood is drawn upon our longhouse. Such a deed must be rewarded. Take some tokens from the basket. <laughs> I crossed the veil with the help of your herfs. I saw through Calf's eyes and learned his tale. Calf saved his people and will be honored. What do you see when you look into the veil? To see what I see would drive you mad. Ask not about my visions. And I will not ask after yours. Calf saved his settlement. Neque sape malale complexiones, agus te, totiteriat in multis super frontis vivorium, pletus dejectus sit, et multi benedicient. Wrong has been righted, giving peace to our dead. You have really risen to the occasion, Eivor. Come claim your full reward. Glad to see you back. Really? Then why did you send Braun to confiscate all my tokens? I'm sorry, Norvet. I should have asked you first. Braun was disappointed we're not having a parade, so... Relax, Eivor. I'm just having fun at your expense. Now, would you like to see my fall collection? Let's see what you have.
I'm off. Be well, friend. Always a pleasure.